I bought 100 banned fast food items, like a burger stacked with 12 patties and a frappuccino that costs $100. Speaking of, the first restaurant is Starbucks, and we're here with Ben Asler to taste test these items. Woo! The first one is a grasshopper frappuccino. Huh? It's pretty sick. The rest of these are gonna get crazier, ending with a $100 frappuccino. 100. We're gonna build up to that one. It's gonna be insane. It's green, grasshoppers are green, right? All right. Aww. It kind of tastes mocha. -y. That actually is good. Yeah. Wait, the, okay, he he wants the rest, I guess. This is a Nutella Frappuccino. You ready to taste this? I'm allergic to Nutella. You trying to kill me? I promise I'm not. Let's give it a try. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Bro, come on, try some. Squid Games Frappuccino. It looks a lot like the guards from Squid Games. Cheers. Oh. I'm picking up some strawberry. Wow. Captain Crunch. It supposedly tastes like the Captain Crunch cereal. It has Nutella. Is that okay? No. That's not a that good face. That tastes terrible. That's not a good face. A butterbeer from Harry Potter. Starbucks remade this and it used to be on the menu. Now it is not. Here we go. Butterbeer, wait, what does that mean? It's, I don't know. Have you ever read Harry Potter? Can't I've never read that. a book. That tastes pretty good. It's so sweet. Bro, Starbucks, you gotta add a little bit mm. less sugar. It's Halloween time, so the next drink is Pumpkin Supreme. It's basically like a spice latte with, with coconut. I don't know why Coconut it's or pumpkin, which one? It's both. Oh. <laughs> That's awful. It's like someone threw up in that cup. That's terrible. The TikTok caramel drink. So many people ordered this on TikTok that it literally became banned. Drink this one. Show me your best TikTok dance. What dance is that? Bro, that's actually really good. This should not be banned. Please put this on the menu. S'mores drink. Bro, it kind of just tastes like hot chocolate. It's kind of mid. It tastes very normal. It tastes normal. It tastes normal. Let's Ban just... it, get it out. But those drinks were nothing compared to what we're trying later in this video. It's insane. And it's time for the moment you've all been waiting for. This is a $100 Frappuccino. I had no idea Starbucks made stuff like this. It looks like throw up. It literally looks horrible. Oh my. Oh my God. Bro, they're like, why does it kind of taste like beef? Wait, I gotta get another taste. Oh my God, bro, that's terrible. Who sold this to you? It's Starbucks. Next restaurant is Shake Shack. We have their version of an ice cream sandwich and I can see why it's banned. It's just a bun and vanilla ice cream. You know me, I love ice cream, so I'm excited to eat this one. That Loki kind of tastes good. We have a bunch more Shake Shack banned items here. I think we should try getting some stranger to try them though. You want to just try one? I'll try one. All right, here we go. What are our thoughts? This is the most life-changing thing I've ever tasted in my mouth. I thought so too. <laughs> this is a grilled cheese from Shake Shack. They don't, they're not supposed to sell this, but they haven't. Sure, it's the bite. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? I like that it's nice and crispy. Why is it banned? They used to be on the menu, now yeah. they're not. Seems like it'd be easy enough for them to just do. That's what I'm saying. Would you, would you tell Shake Shack to bring it back? Why not, yeah. You want anything? Don't run away from me. You want it? Don't run away. Don't run away. You want to try this banned fast food item? Uh, no, thank you. Okay. It's a banned fast food item. Do you want to try it? This has four patties and uh, bacon. I like it. Should they bring it back? Bring it back. There we go. Shake Shack, you heard it here. Try this secret menu item from um, okay. Shake Shack. Okay. Do you want to try a secret menu item? You want to try it? Okay, sweet. This is a lettuce wrap and it's called a protein burger. Okay. It's not sold at Shake Shack. You want to give it a try? Sure. All right. Tell us your honest thoughts. We're gonna try all these items at In-N-Out, ending with this four x four burger. And I am here to try them with Eliana. First item. A Neapolitan shake. It has every flavor of ice cream in one shake. Apparently it's pretty popular. I've never had it. Okay, wow, there's a lot going on in this, for sure. It just tastes like diabetes. Should this stay as a banned item? I think so, yeah. Okay. All right, now that you've tried that shake, it's time we get into the good stuff, the food. Which it's one do you want to try first? I don't know. Look at this thing. This has four patties. How is anyone even going to eat that? I, I, you know, you'd be surprised. First one is this grilled cheese. To me, it kind of looks as if there's a burger with no patty. It's literally just a burger. What are our thoughts? Is it is it the best grilled cheese you've ever tasted? It tastes like an In-N-Out burger with no patty. Dang. Next item is the Colossal. This has four patties. I feel like this shouldn't exist. It should not exist. No. I wonder why it's banned. <laughs> oh, how is it? It's just a lot of meat, you know? It's like a big mouthful. <laughs> Did you take another bite of that? No, no. It's a root beer float, yeah. Root beer flute? I mean, yeah, it's just, I mean, it's okay. Our next item are animal fries. They we look have. hard as a rock. Oh my God, look, can I like pick this? 
That is not appetizing at all. Oh my God. Why are these so famous? Cheers. I kind of wish I didn't eat those. This item had no patty and this only has the patty. I feel like we were probably supposed to combine them, but yeah. that's not. <laughs> Oh, it's really good, guys. Okay, I'll let you try this one. This is called the Spicy Animal Style Burger. I don't understand that. You guys know I hate spicy food. Mm. How are you doing that so casually? Overall, in and out I don't think you're winning this one. On to the next restaurant. The next fast food place is Taco Bell. And if you're wondering why I'm dressed like the Hulk, you'll find out in a second. Let's go. Here we go. I'm pretty nervous. Uh, do you have the Incredible Hulk? <laughs> you got the Incredible Hulk. Not me. The burrito. Well, that's a lot of guacamole. That's actually pretty good. Next up, we've got these nachos with potatoes on top. Not gonna lie, this looks busting. Don't, don't say that. Okay. Wow, this is this double grilled chicken quesadilla. Much better than McDonald's. So far, Taco Bell is doing well. The tie-dye freeze. This one's banned because it's tie-dye. Take a look at this. It's every single one of their flavors mixed into one drink. Oh, that's amazing. Not good at all. Wrapping paper made it taste better. Chili cheese burrito. There is no chili in here. I can see why that's a secret. For the final item, it's the Superman. It's good, but it would be better if it was called the Hulk burrito. Talk about, you did a pretty good job. Next restaurant is Five Guys, and we're gonna see how my dad reacts to this food. He's gonna try it with us. All right, dad, what is your reaction to all of this food here? It's I don't, it, I'm not excited to eat it. All right, go for it. Ready? No, thanks. I don't want you touching my food. Okay. I'll do this one. Okay. Oh, he's going the big baby. The rumor is the president ordered this for his whole, the whole White House. Can you do a video where we like go on vacation or get some exercise, go skiing? Like, why are we eating disgusting food? It's not disgusting. Yes. Oh, whoa. Oh, the heat. The no. Heat. The heat. Oh, the heat. Yeah. It's really spicy. Okay, I need a break. Can you cut? I don't want to do it. You got it. Ah, get over with it. That's the worst hot dog I've ever put in my mouth. You ready for this? No. Good luck. Hey, cheers. Wow, that's delicious. I love that a lot. And next up at Five Guys, we have the double grilled cheeseburger. This is both double grilled cheese and double burger. What? Wow. I literally think I ate a full burger just now. Because go, go on to your next fast food because Five Guys kind of sucks. Sorry, Five Guys. Dang, that's actually pretty good. Why was this banned? This big McChicken, it has beef and chicken inside of it. The vegans are going to be mad at me. That's actually pretty good. Next up is the McFloat. It has Dr. Pepper and ice cream. They don't sell this anymore. Let's give it a try. Oh, wow. That's pretty good. Next item is this Big Mac and Cheese, meaning it literally has no meat. I can see why that's banned. Poor man's Big Mac. Delicious. The orange creamsicle, but it has ice cream. You guys already know. Say it with me, Hudson loves ice cream. Hudson loves ice cream. All right, let's go. Wait, wait! That is not appetizing at all. Let's see if we can get a good cheese pull. You guys, you guys want the orange creamsicle? Vanilla ice cream McFlurry with cookies inside. Chocolate chip cookies. Let's take a bite. Ew. Final item in McDonald's, we have an apple pie McFlurry. I don't like apple pie, but it's almost Thanksgiving, so. Wow, that's a sweet apple pie right there. Overall, McDonald's actually had some pretty good banned items. We're gonna try all these banned items at Burger King, ending with the Angry Whopper. You won't believe what's inside. The next restaurant is Burger King, and I'm here with Sophie Dossie to try the next items. Ready for this? I'm ready. I feel like we're missing something. We are. Oh! Uh. This is better. This All right. is a lot better. Let's try the first item. Kay. The first item is called the Mustard Whopper. Apparently it is soaked in mustard and I hate mustard. Take it for the oh, team. Oh, wow, this is. This looks horrid. I'm gonna have a little mustard with my burger. <laughs> what do we think? Do we do we need the bucket? Do we need the bucket or are we swallowing? We don't need a bucket. Okay, we don't not need yet. A bucket. I'm definitely eating more mustard than yeah. Uh oh, burger. man, that's oh. not good. It's kind of floppy. Here, try All right, let's give it a, oh, you made me go with the mustard side. What the, <laughs> All right. Eat the mustard side. That's like a one at a time. That's four. The Royal Rodeo Burger. I have no idea what's in this. this what's is wrong so with heavy. it? Wait, can I feel? This is so heavy. Are we using the bucket? Why is it? That looks good. It just wasn't good. Why is Burger King so bad? The next item is called the Surf and Turf. Oh, but there's fish in here. Ew. Send it. 
What are our thoughts? Good? It's getting a little fishy. I wonder some... why. Right, the next item is called the Royal Bird and Beef. Oh my goodness. It's very average. Over here, we have Frings. Fries and onions. Yay, I'm so <laughs> not excited. Ready? So you hate fried onions and I hate fries. So here we go. It's gonna be wonderful. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Why is it so full and mushy? Next, we have the Angry Whopper. <gasps> oh no, what is it? Do you know what's in here? No. Here's a bucket. Off me. <laughs> I'm gonna the bucket. This is the quad stacker. Um. I see cause... why this is banned. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is it going in the bucket? Oh no. Oh, I hated it. It's called the chicken parmesan. All these banned items. I understand why they're banned. I'm not gonna lie. That one looks gross. Hudson, what is this? This is called a Coke float. This is our final item. I think it has ice cream in it. That's all I know. Is it good? All right, no, let me try, let me try, let me try. This is the best one. Wait. wait okay, wait, all right, well, one out of 10. Wow. I mean, wait, no. These banned items should really stay banned. I would argue so. Next restaurant is Jack in the Box, and we've got a ton of banned items. Okay, that was a lot. Jalapeno popper nachos. I can see why they're banned. Bacon bacon cheeseburger. This is a criminal amount of bacon. Look at all this. I can taste the patty that's cold. This bun is hanging on for dear life. How many patties are in here? Well, it's a four by four, so I'll be four. The biggest burger I've ever tasted. This is the Western taco. I have to put these onion rings into this currently existing taco. I'm gonna do it the Justin Bieber way. Actually pretty good. This is the loaded breakfast sandwich. Wait, why does it taste very good? Oh, do I have to eat that? Yes. I don't want to eat this, dude. Is this a big enough bite? Yeah, you gotta get some bacon on there. Allison, you're telling me this looks appetizing you? And the final item at Jack in the Box is this enormous burger. Look at this. I don't even know if I can fit this in my mouth. Ready? It's so sus. Oh my god. Bro, okay. This is officially the biggest and worst burger I've ever tasted. Next up is Chipotle, and I have a great idea for the next item. Let's do it. I saw a YouTube video by Jenny Hoyos that showed how you can get a $2 burrito. Let's see if it works. This life hack was permanently banned ever since the viral video, so we'll see if we can do this successfully. Uh, single taco. I do extra rice, that taco. And the extra pinto beans, please. Okay, thank you, my friend. All right, this is a crazy overloaded taco that we got for just four bucks, a little bit more than I was expecting. And just like that, we made a $4 burrito. See how it tastes. I think we just found the hack to like life. Next item is a burrito dia. So we're gonna give it a try. First, we gotta see that cheese pill. Ooh. <laughs> the guac, here we go. It's actually pretty good. I bet you didn't know you could buy nachos at Chipotle. Crunchy, hint of lime. They're delicious. I don't know what to say. It's a lote. It's like basically like a corn sauce, a corn with sauce. I don't know if I'm a fan of that one. Last thing, a quesarito. This is a burrito wrapped in a quesadilla. Look at this thick boy. I don't like the lettuce stuff in here. But Chipotle, you're in the lead. In the restaurant, I am here with Lexi Rivera. We have five banned items here for good reason looking at them. Yeah. Like this 12 patty <laughs> burger that's falling over. You excited to try these? I don't think I can try these. I'm a pescatarian, but I'm oh excited to see you try them. Starting with this barnyard burger, I am terrified. Oh, I'm glad I have Lexi's emotional support. <laughs> this looks like way too many buns, way too many bacon, way too many everything. Okay. It's Give it a so, try. so giant. Like. It's like unseasoned. There's nothing in it. What? This should stay banned for sure. <laughs> Don't get this. Don't get the partner burger. Please. Next up, you're gonna be trying the quadruple baconator. No! My burger! This one is called the quadruple baconator. Okay. Um, I by the looks of it. There's I, way too much onion. Yeah, on. I, I don't say. think it's gonna be very good, but I want to get your opinion. Oh, okay. I don't. Okay, how is it go. so big? All right. It's a little sus. All right, ready? <laughs> Mm. Yeah. Ah, this one wasn't good. Mm. Not good. So the next one is called the fossil. Okay. And apparently there's six patties in here. Okay. So good luck. That's not bad. It's not? Wait, what? You like this one? 
Well, it's so giant, but it's eh, you know? Well, do you think it should be banned? No, I'd say unban that one. That's delicious. Okay, I would pay for the that. Fossil. I need to wash my fingers off in the water. No, oh, no, Hudson. Now it's time for me to try something. Yes. So this is a Frosty Flow, and it's root beer and a chocolate Frosty. Yes. Okay. I kind of don't like this. But the million dollar question, should it stay banned? I think it should. It is time to try the T-Rex burger. This probably weighs like 30 pounds. Yeah, no, definitely. I don't even, I don't even know how you're gonna eat this. Oh my gosh, bro. How am I supposed to eat this? this I don't insane. know. Two, one. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> you know what? That's terrible. Really? 12 patties is not worth it. It's not good. No. That was way too much fast food in one day. So should it stay banned? That should stay banned. Oh, okay. Oh, Hudson! Oh. The best fast food place is definitely Chipotle. If you're looking for some secret menu items, go there. By the way, we tried in this video to waste as little food as possible, but of course it was very hard. Because of that, my vegetarian sister is making me not eat meat for every burger that was wasted to basically cancel it out so we really didn't waste any food. And also I'm gonna be making a donation to a local food bank. See you next week, Matter Movement.